Hi everybody, it's Marcy. Welcome to, oh, I thought I lost my favorite spatula. Um, welcome to another week. Uh, today I'm going to make something that my friend Caroline had uh, sort of mentioned and I thought, ooh, that would be so perfect with our products. So it's sort of a shortbread cookie, but I'm using our sea salt almond cookie mix. Mm, one of my favorites. It's so delicious. And um, our peppermint bark. Now what I'm going to do, and this is a little bit backwards, but I have to do it this way because the cream is hot. I have a little tiny bit of cream. Um, so what, here, I guess I need to turn you down. Uh, okay. So I've got some of our peppermint mini bars. I swear these are the best thing ever. Um, chopped up. And I'm going to pour these into the uh, uh, whipping cream that is hot. Where did my little chopper go? Oh, there it is. Um, because I want it to sit in there a little while. <laughs> that just made a big mess. Um, I want it to sit in there for a little while and uh, start to melt all of those delicious white chocolate bars. Now, I know I've told you before, if, you've never if you don't like white chocolate, you've never tried ours, you have to try it because ours is fabulous. Um, aside from being one of the few companies that really actually uses white chocolate, um, it's just so smooth. It's not as icky sweet as some people tend to think white chocolate is because it's actually made with cocoa butter. So we're gonna let that sort of sit and melt the chocolate. And then we're gonna make these delicious cookies, sea salt almond cookie mix. Okay, oh, so Caroline might have been the inspiration, but guess what, she can't hand these because she is allergic to nuts. Okay, my dog is thinking this is a great place to be right now. Okay, so the recipe calls for two cups of our mix. This is another thing I just love about our recipe, so easy. And you can adapt them. I think I'm going to go ahead and make a whole one because I'm going to make this in a pan. I don't know if you can see my dog, like, pushing me out of the way. Okay. So we've got that. Two cups of that. A stick of butter. And you can mix this by hand or with a mixer. I'm going to go mixer. Okay, let's lose that. <clears throat> okay, so we've got uh, the stick of butter, um, the cookie mix, and one egg. Nope, and I usually like to break it into something else, but I didn't do that. So we're just going to have to pray that this egg is okay and I don't drop any shell in. There we go. Okay, one egg. How easy is that? Not to mention, look at this. There's like almost no cleanup. You know I always love that. Okay, we're going to mix this real quick. Very little shooting out this time. Always like that. There we go. And you'll see this like pulls together in no time. I'm going to give tell you probably less than a minute, but we'll soon see. Uh, it was a softened stick of butter. And I do have to tell you something else. Tomorrow's live with, uh, with Misty. Oh my gosh, look at how fast that is. Is going to be very fun. We're going to be traveling to Cairo. Um, okay, let's see. So... We've got that. I've got my pan already greased. And I'll get this out of the way. I love when I really do it from start to finish, like live with you guys. Okay. Now I'm going to push this down into here so it's more of a, a pan cookie. And even that is not such a um, big deal. Okay, I'm going to bake these. I'm going to check them at 12 minutes. Uh, it might need a little longer since it's 
in the pan format. And I will take a picture of what I do then, but I can tell you what I'm gonna do right, well, I'll mix this up and show you. Okay, look at that. That is ready to go. Uh, okay, so let's see how this is doing. This should be pretty ready to go. Oh yeah, that's nice and melted. I might even add one more. The peppermint seems to be at the bottom. Yeah, I'm gonna add uh, maybe one more bar of the peppermint. Let's see how hot that is. And we'll break it up a little bit, just not as chopped. But that'll be nice in there. Okay, because I wanted it a little bit thicker. I might have added too much cream when I was in, but it'll still be delicious. So I will show you what this looks like when we are done. Uh, in the meantime, uh, hi, Caroline. <laughs> I was just talking about you. Um, in the meantime, um, please, if you know anybody who does gifting for the holidays, please think of me. Um, so easy. You can call me. We can do it in no time. Uh, it's It ships right to their house. You can put a personalized note in. I mean, really, you really don't want to go out to the stores. It's crazy out there right now. And... Um, it's safer and it's better and um, you can't find these products in stores so people will be very impressed that you found something unique so give me a call um, I am also in the middle of a couple of fundraisers and you'll be hearing more about those later but make sure and join me oh I didn't even tell you tomorrow we are going to um, uh, go travel getaways is going to Egypt for a dish that I have never made before. We'll see how it turns out, but it's with our products, it can't be bad. So thanks for watching, see you tomorrow.